When the Spaniards got to the Philippines, they saw just how the Filipinos utilized vinegar to marinate their fish, pork, as well as hen. In his works, Pedro de San Buenaventura classified the Filipino variation, adobo de los naturales adobo of the citizens. The origins of the Philippines' most widely known recipe are challenging to trace. Yet we do understand a couple of aspects of the beginnings of adobo, and also exactly how it's developed right into the recipe Filipinos like today. Keep reading to discover the many faces of adobo, and also why it motivates such dedication in its followers. A couple of topics in the Philippines increase as numerous varying viewpoints is the best means to make adobo. The factor is that a great adobo is a life-altering meal. At it's the majority of standard degree, adobo is a recipe of healthy protein braised in vinegar as well as spiced with garlic and also black peppercorns. Past that, there is a really little contract. Allows backtrack a little bit. At its heart, adobo is a procedure of food preparation, not a dish. The flavor of the vinegar is softened over reduced warmth, magnifying the taste of the meat. And also producing a smooth, mouth-watering sauce that is constantly, constantly offered with aromatic white rice. Adobo's lengthy trips are melding of societies, as well as ardent protectors all integrated to inform a tasty as well as varied tale. Where fish and shellfish were abundant, adobo ng pucit, squid adobo with squid ink, came to be prominent. In southern Luzon, where warmth and also coconut milk are prominent components. Adobo ng gata, adobo with coconut milk and also environment-friendly finger chilies, arose. Over the last few years, adobo has actually relocated past its origins as a simple island recipe. Thrilling restaurants at Filipino dining establishment Purple Yam in New York and also the love of previous United States President Barack Obama. Promising Filipino cooks shred the meat from adobo stew to produce mouth-watering flakes to leading salads. Or to stuff in sushi. Adobo has actually included on programs like Top Chef as well as continues to be the best examination of any kind of Filipino chef's guts. Several of the Chinese investors that ventured throughout the area marketing their items. Resolved in the Philippines. They brought with them a variety of active ingredients that were swiftly taken on by the residents. Consisting of panchit noodles and also soy sauce. In lots of places of the Philippines, soy sauce involved change making use of salt in residents' cooking areas. Therefore soy sauce is still thought about as a crucial component of a great adobo in many houses. We understand the Malay voyages that initially landed in the Philippines utilized vinegar as well as salt as a means of protecting food maintaining it edible for longer. In the warm exotic environment on the islands, vinegar shows up over and over in typical dishes. Going back to a time prior to refrigeration, Filipinos were currently preparing their healthy protein in a marinade of vinegar and also salt. Prior to the Chinese investors showed up. Thank you. Please like share and subscribe.